Hi everyone and welcome back to clean up with Kelly today's video is going to be a power hour and I'm going to try to get a lot of this done in one hour here is the kitchen we went to the park today and ate lunch and now my daughter is sleeping and this is what we have so here is my list of things to do so let's get started. So lucky to be yours. So the first thing that's on my list is to pick up the downstairs area. And as you can see, there's a lot of toys and trash everywhere. So I'm gonna just get started from the front and work towards the back. I'm mainly just picking up toys and setting them aside for her so she can play with them after her. reason I have all these papers on the floor is because after our walk we went to get the mail and I just kind of tossed it in that little bin area and when she was out and about playing she decided to pick them all up and throw them everywhere. So I'm just going to move the stroller into the little office area for now and get back to picking everything up. If this is your first time here, I would love to welcome you to my channel. And if you would like, you can hit the red subscribe button and tap the bell. I post videos weekly, at least three times a week, and mostly cleaning videos. So if you like these types of videos, definitely make sure you subscribe. now that everything is picked up I'm going to start on putting all the clean dishes away and then putting any dirty ones into the dishwasher now I did run these earlier this morning so they were a lot wetter than normal so you'll see me drying everything off If you're interested in how I organize my kitchen, I just made a kitchen pantry organization video and I cleaned and organized that whole area and then I also did our spices and baking supplies. So if you want to check that out, I will leave it above here. had a couple pots and pans to clean so it didn't take me too long but after scrubbing pans the sink is always dirty so I'm going to clean that up afterwards.
So after the sink is nice and clean, I'm going to put some orange essential oil down the drain and run a little bit of hot water just to make it smell really, really good. Just checking my time here, I got about 40 minutes left. So now that the first two tasks are done, I'm going to go on to vacuuming. Usually by this time of the day, this area definitely needs a good vacuuming. There's a lot of snacks and things on the floor, so I always try to vacuum during nap time if I can. I've had this Dyson V7 for over a year now and I love it, especially if you have stairs. It's so wonderful just to carry it up and not have to worry about the cord. If you want to see a little bit more, I'll leave a link below so you can check that out. I love, love, love vacuum lines. If you're new here, this girl loves vacuum lines. Whenever I'm with you, I am alright. There's something about the way you make me feel inside. I'm counting down the days till we fly away. Edging to the sun, only you and me are. Next, I'm just gonna put the pillows back and we're good as new. I'm gonna start vacuuming the kitchen. Again, this whole area definitely needs a good vacuuming. Crumbs everywhere all day long. <laughs> I make food at home pretty much for every meal. So by this time of the day, there's always something on the floor. If you're enjoying this video so far, make sure that you give this video a thumbs up. It really it does make a difference and it definitely helps out my channel. Thank you so much if you do that. Now I'm just going to uh, put all of her toys back so that when she wakes up, we can play again. The sea, think we're getting close. We should take a pick, baby strike a pose. Next on my list is to wipe the counters. Remember every day. Today I'm going to be using my Method Granite Cleaner. If you have granite, I definitely recommend this cleaner. It smells amazing and it, my counters always look so shiny afterwards. One of my earlier videos, I did a granite ceiling tutorial. Let me know if you'd like to see an updated version. I filmed it on my phone and the quality wasn't the best. So comment down below if you want me to film that for you again and it's time for me to do it so that's why I'm asking. This cactus blossom candle from A Bath and Body Works is so so amazing. I'm almost done with it and I think I got it less than a week and a half ago. It's really, really good. Sometimes when I'm thinking about us Before we got lost and we parted Back to back we would carry on and do anything for what we started But this time we could break I'm running dry Everything's the same We'll try tonight But this time we're not safe and sound Not safe and sound What if I'm not good for you? What if you're not good for me?
course I have to clean my oven. I'm going to be using my method degreaser. This is my go-to for my oven. It always works so well and I have a ton of grease going on here. We do anything for what we started. But this time we could break. I'm running dry. Everything's the same. We'll try to know this time we're not safe and sound. Not safe and sound. As you can see there is a very stubborn spot so I just sprayed some on there and let that soak in and then I ended up just using the sponge on it and that worked really well. So checking my timer here, I got about 24 minutes left. If you've never done a power hour before, I definitely recommend it because you have goals, you check them off and you get it done and it's a great way to spend your time if you have a lot to do. Next, I'm going to quickly clean up our kitchen table. I'm not going to fuss around with anything on it. I just want to wipe the spots that are visible. Oh, yeah. Don't you know we're getting old for this game? So why you keep playing, boy? Walking around like you're some kind of star. Okay, so last thing on my list is to mop. So I'm going to start doing that. I just use a Libman mop with a pad that's on the bottom. I usually will run some hot water and some soap and then I have solution in the tank and I usually use Fabuloso and water. On this day, we had donated a bunch of stuff to Salvation Army. So I had everything lined up in this area and then they had to go upstairs and down and track dirt in so that's why I really wanted to make sure this area was cleaned up. So everything is done and I have a little bit of time left so I'm going to uh, spray everything down with this room spray. It's okay, so my timer is just about up. About a minute left. My daughter just woke up. So I'm just going to show you real quick nice and clean counters are wiped the table is clean the oven is wiped down there's no more dishes in the sink which is like the best thing ever the room is cleaned up and vacuumed and then our entryway the floor is nice and clean. I really hope this video gave you some motivation to get up and get some things done in your house. You can get a lot done in an hour and it makes a huge difference. Thank you guys so much for watching. And again, if you're new, I would love to have you here. So definitely subscribe before you leave and hit the bell. 
Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!